The man behind bars tonight after leading police on that wild ride. 10 News reporter Judith Rotana joins us after talking to neighbors who saw the crash happen. Mark and Brooks, tonight a 42-year-old man is facing charges for failure to comply. Police tried to pull him over in Sydney this afternoon, but he never stopped. Dash cam footage captures a moment police first try to stop this white Chevrolet Friday afternoon. The driver, Travel Scott Sr., runs the stop sign and the chase is on. Police followed Scott down Fair Road off Interstate 75 in Sydney. Video shows him driving in the wrong lane as he starts to pick up speed, ultimately reaching 100 miles per hour. We have a lot of accidents out here, but uh, nothing like what went on today. Mickey Stevens lives just down the road from where the chase ended. Heard was sirens coming down the road, and when I looked out, they were flying by. Just as Scott reaches Stevens' neighborhood, video shows him again in the wrong lane lose control of the vehicle. He narrowly misses a driver headed in the opposite direction. That driver ends up in a ditch. That's when the suspect stops his vehicle and gives himself up. Steven says her daughter was in the driveway when it all happened. She brought her husband lunch and uh, she saw the whole thing, said the guy come out of the car and was on the ground. Steven says she sees drivers speed down this 40 mile per hour road, but a chase reaching 100 miles per hour is different. Police and everybody was all over the place. It was quite a, seemed to be quite an ordeal. After police cuff Scott and pat him down, the video ends with police escorting him to their vehicle. Police say Travel Scott Sr. had four felony warrants for his arrest and no driver's license. Judith Ratana, 2 News, working for you.